In what the Russian Foreign Ministry has described as a terrorist attack, four armed gunmen uh, have laid siege to a concert hall just north of Moscow during a uh, during the run-up to a concert, and twenty people, I believe, twenty people have been killed, and about 6,000 people were in the concert hall at the point when the gunmen invaded. And um, Maria Zakharova, uh, the spokesperson, the um, foreign ministry spokesperson, has called on the international community to condemn the incident, which uh, has been called a monstrous crime. Well, of course, I'm sure everyone condemns uh, terrorism of this sort, where... Uh, civilians are put under extraordinary stress by armed gunmen. It's something that uh, one, one, one absolutely has to condemn. Children and teenagers were among the uh, uh, people in the crowd expecting to have a uh, an evening's entertainment and instead they were being held at gunpoint in what must have been a terrifying and um, frightening ordeal. Um, there was a ballroom dancing competition next door, I believe, um, which people were attending with their children when the shooting happened uh, the, uh, the, as people tried to leave the various venues in the complex. There was a crush. Children were running um, in ball gowns, and, and I'm sure that added to the chaos and the, uh, the, the, the general terror that was created. Apparently, um, this is not a Chechen incident. So I'm not quite sure at this moment who uh, who is claiming responsibility. And um, uh, it's also, I, I believe, emphatically not Ukrainian. Uh, but there are many there are many factions at work in Moscow society in in Russia. And it's a society, certainly, which is, which is not without troubles. Um, and at a time when, when uh, we we have just witnessed uh, a most extraordinarily constructed and staged fake election, uh, it's um, it, it it must come as a great shock um, that. Uh, the, the, the terrorism, which, which of course was exactly um, the the stuff that ignited and um, and drove President Putin into power in the first place, the the, the terrorist threats. And terrorism is rearing its head again in modern Russia. Uh, I, I I would imagine it's a time of great anxiety.